And I saw a video of you playing Stairway to Heaven at the Kennedy Center Honors in front of Led Zeppelin with (laughs) Jason Bonham, John Bonham's son on the drums. And just seeing, um, I guess, the emotional impact watching, you know, from the video I saw that you see the camera of Robert Plant and Jimmy Page and seeing them get emotional and you and Anne getting emotional playing the tune. What did that moment mean for you? playing that song in that context. Yeah, well we didn't see what was happening up in the in the uh, you know where the, they were sitting up in the upper level up there. So we didn't know what was happening until we saw the the edited footage later a few weeks later when it was going to air and our experience as at the time was really nerve-wracking, you know. Because you know, not only is it you're playing Stairway to Heaven for Led Zeppelin themself, themselves, but you're the president and first lady of the United States are there. All these dignitaries were there. And it was Washington, D.C., for Christ's sake. You know, you're in the, the lap of the seat of government, you know, and with the president in, in the room and it was like, okay, well, okay, well, if there's ever a time to try to get something right, now would be that time, you know? <laughs> so yeah. we were kind of um, <sighs> taking a really cleansing, deep yoga-type breath, you know, before we walked out there. And my knees were shaking, of course, you know, like, okay, there's no pressure, you know, okay. But then, you know, the idea was to be deliberate and take it slow, <laughs> you know, cause be, and don't make a mistake. <laughs> and it was cold. It was December that time we were there. We rehearsed one time with all of the uh, sections in one big room. It was freezing cold, um, big drafty place. My hands were f- kind of frozen and we, st- I tried to start at rehearsal. I tried to start Stairway to Heaven. My hands were so cold. I was like really screwing it up, you know, cause it's, it's kind of not easy to play either. So the guys in the band were like, if you want us to shadow you on the day so tomorrow when we do this, I'll play, I'll shadow you and play it with you. So if you screw it up, you know, it'll be there. It's like, no, I just have to warm up my hands. It'll be fine. Don't worry about, you know, you don't have to help me. So the next day I was even doubly more nervous because it was still cold. And I've, I had my hands underneath my husband's (laughs) armpits, you know, before we walked out there because I had to have warm hands. There was nothing but that warming my hands somehow that could help me get it done right, you know. So, you know, it was a little nerve-wracking. And then, um, but it turned out to be such a beautiful thing, as it turned out. Later to see Zeppelin, you know, I think because Jason Bonham, too, the son of Don Bonham was there, I think that was a large part of their emotionalism, watching the song go down, because, you know, he was a kid growing up with, when they were writing those songs and and his dad was around in Zeppelin at the time. So, you know, I th- and the, that's kind of a family thing for those guys, I think, to see Jason up there. He was in heart for a while too, Jason was. Yeah. Yeah. But it's a, it's a family affair, no doubt. <laughs> 